With Thanksgiving tomorrow, some were out doing last minute grocery shopping today. And as 7 News reporter Chad Charette tells us, you may be paying a bit more to put dinner on the table this year. It's almost a given that you'll see turkey, stuffing, and cans of cranberry sauce on the Thanksgiving table. Their prices, however, are anything but constant. Fuel, um, labor, you know, those prices definitely can reflect what consumers pay at, at the grocery store and also Mother Nature. On average, prices are up, the biggest increase coming in the form of turkey. The Farm Bureau says a 16-pound bird will set you back a couple more dollars this year. Other staples, like stuffing and milk, have only increased by a few cents. Some items, like whipped cream and cranberries, are actually cheaper this year. One reason for that is an increased supply in, in cranberry production here in the United States. Plus, we saw increased imports coming in from Canada. Although prices have gone up, the Farm Bureau tells us they've increased significantly less than previous years, and that could be a good sign for things to come. Last year, it was just over $66. This year, we're just over $70. Um, while that still can be a concern for some families when it comes to, to paying for, for the food to put on the Thanksgiving table, it's definitely slowing down in terms of the inflation rate. One shopper we spoke to says prices are still too high, even if the rate of inflation is slowing down. Oh, that, they've gone up less. Well, going up is going up, you know, and for people who really are on a budget, it's really tough. Others say they've been able to mostly offset the increased costs through the strategic use of coupons and sales. I've just been watching that and grabbing some things as, as we've gone along, and this last minute run was just very small items, so. Looking forward to next year, the Farm Bureau says it's too early to predict costs, but it hopes to see inflation continue to shrink. Chad Charette, 7 News.